timing. Timing is measured non-invasively with the QA meter prong and the X-ray device control technique set to a preset timing which I have selected at 5 milliseconds each at 60 kV and 10 milliamps. Why do we perform timing? Timing quality directly impacts the total quantity of the radiation exposure to the patient. Accurate timing exposures are critical for image quality and conclusive evidence of reducing high patient dosage, which are linked to increased risks of cancer. I'm going to set up the QA meter right now. This is the prana which we will select the QA browser. We select panoramic dental. Select all. And we are looking for this number right here for MS. And we're going to change our filter. Now we're ready to take a shot. Come back over here to the control panel. We select 70 kV, 10 MA at 5 seconds. Press the test button. And we're now ready to take a shot. We set up our piranha as shown. Here's our piranha connected to our half value layer scan, which is directly in line with the beam. Here we are at our exposure control button. Green means go. We will measure it on the QA device and report. Four, five, oh, two milliseconds or five seconds. So for test one. We're entering for 5402, and we're going to take a second shot. Press test again. Now we're ready. Press the exposure button. This time we get 5401. So we enter 5401 here. And we'll take another shot. Press the test button. Ready to go. Exposure ready. Four oh two. Press the test button again. Green means go. Exposure control, press green to go. And we have 5402. So our final reading is 5402. We go to the average, which is 5401. Here we will take another series of shots, other than the 5 for reproducibility. We could do 10 or 15 milliseconds.